Welcome back to the channel, guys. In just over five minutes, I want to take you along with me on one of the most incredible fishing trips I've ever experienced. It's Saturday, May 20th, and we just wrapped up the men's retreat at Appleton, Wisconsin at the Apostolic Truth Church under Pastor Aaron Soto. An incredible weekend with an incredible group of guys. And after the Saturday session, Pastor Soto said that Eric and also Frank, they were going to take me up to the Bay of Green Bay and we were going to troll for some walleye. They had reached out to their buddy Jay, the boat captain, and he agreed to take us up there to some of his good spots and let us try to troll and catch these walleyes. The bite was on and so of course I'm never going to turn down an opportunity to do some fishing, especially on the Bay of Green Bay and also trolling for walleyes. I've never done that before. I've never really trolled at all before. And so this was a pretty exciting opportunity for me. We get out there, Jay goes to his good spots and uh, we put out all eight lines as you see here in the video. And we start to just slowly troll. Jay's an, a stellar fisherman. He knows all the stuff, knows all the equipment, knows the right depth, all that good stuff. And uh, sure enough, we were probably trolling for, uh, I don't know, 10 minutes or so. And the very first fish that we got on happened to be a 55-inch muskie. Never in any of our wildest dreams did we ever think that that would be what we caught first. They hand me the, the fishing reel. I actually tried to pass it off. I'm like, hey, somebody else want to do it? They're like, nope, this is your fish. And so I'm like, okay. And none of us knew what it was. And uh, as I begin to fight this fish, I'm like, man, this fish is heavy. And I said, this is probably the heaviest fish I've ever, I've ever felt fight. At one point in time, I had reeled him all the way into about 25 feet. And then the next thing I know, he was all the way back out at about 86 feet. Should I keep reeling or just yeah. let him do okay. it? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Right, you let up. My bicep is on fire right now. <laughs> You're doing great. You got what it takes there, brother, right? You got what it takes. That's a pretty fish. He's not driving. Come this way. Take it easy. There you go. Oh, he's coming. Now he's he's gonna when he sees the boat, he's gonna take a run again. So get ready. Yeah. He's gonna take a run. He's not gonna like it. Of course, as it got closer and closer to the boat, every one of us knew that this was a big fish. And of course, you know, when they come out of the water, they look even bigger. And uh, you can hear the excitement as I was reeling it in. Jay's instructing me. Frank and them are kind of coaching me along. And it was just an incredible experience. The whole thing, it was teamwork, camaraderie. Uh, as we get this thing up to the boat, Jay is trying to get the net down around its head and get it into the net. And he was having a hard time getting the whole fish to fit into the net. And so it did a flip on him and you can watch Jay as he rolls the net with it and still keeps the fish somewhat captivated in the net. And now the tail ends in the net. He yells at Frank, get the other net. Frank grabs the other net, runs down, sticks it in. And then both Jay and Frank literally pick this muskie up and put it into the boat as you can see right here and of course it was all high fives it was all shouting and all of that good stuff as we begin to unnet the fish <laughs> look at this guy <laughs> oh my oh goodness. my word that is no that's the new biggest muskie in the boat I cannot express how blessed I feel that these guys would take the time out of their day to make this happen for me. As you heard Jay, the captain, say this is the biggest muskie wow. that's been in his boat, and that says a lot that because is Jay amazing. is a stellar fisherman, does it all the time. And truth be told, this could have been any one of their fish, and from my understanding, none of them have caught a muskie 
this big. And so the fact that they were high-fiving me and they were celebrating with me, this is my first muskie. I would have been thankful with a 30-inch muskie, let alone a 55-inch muskie. In fact, when I went back to the church on Sunday, I had other fishermen from the church who saw the picture said they have been fishing all their life and they've never made it into the 50-inch category. These guys are stellar, and the fact that they rejoiced as much as they did when we got the fish into the boat just says a lot about all of them. And so thanks again, guys, for such an incredible fishing adventure.